Yo, what's up? A lot of my videos are me just laughing and exposing bad YouTubers, but today, I'm not just dealing with your average bad YouTuber, I'm dealing with the worst person I've met on YouTube. This all started about two weeks ago. I got a comment from somebody begging me to expose this random channel. The channel was called Animal Planet, and it had some like Spanish letters next to it. I looked through a few videos like this one, it's literally a video of a rabbit holding somebody's hand. It's kind of cute, okay. The comment that told me to expose this channel also mentioned that this is one of the dumbest people on YouTube, but I didn't understand. I was literally seeing videos of rabbits and nothing else. Nothing was bad about this channel. Well, that's what I thought. A couple of days later, I saw a video that popped up on my recommended. The title of this video says, Rabbit, OMG, animals so cute followed up by more blabber, but the thumbnail is a picture of a rabbit in a small box and it kind of looks scared. I decided to click on this video just to see what this was and this might have been the best decision I've ever made. This is just a six second video of a rabbit, that's literally all it is, but I noticed something. This video was posted by that Animal Planet channel that that comment told me to look at a couple of days ago. I also noticed that this video had six comments, so I decided to see what people were saying. Alicia Williams said, The poor rabbit. It has no toys, food, water, or a warm place to sleep. Rabbits are not toys or props to put in videos. Even though she kinda sounds like a Karen, I agree with her. But guess who replied to this comment? The Animal Planet channel. And you wanna know what they said? Rabbit emoji heart, rabbit emoji heart. Are you serious? This channel recorded a bunny rabbit inside of a small box with no food, no water, no toys, and once somebody called them out for it, they just spammed emojis? That was it. I knew I had to go back to this channel and explore. This decision to go back to their channel was one of the best things I've ever done. The amount of things I discovered when I went back to their channel was absolutely insane. Get ready. If you don't know already, I'm a hardcore gamer. I love playing games, but for some reason recently, gaming just hasn't felt the same. That was until I found Honkai Impact 3rd. It's a free cross-platform game that I downloaded onto my phone, and I've been having so much fun with it. It's a fast-paced action game with a fully voiced main story, and you can also level up all of your characters and slowly start to become a beast wrecking everything and everybody that you see. One of my favorite parts about this game is the fact that the story is fully voiced. There's also a bunch of beautiful animations to make the story more captivating. As you play the game, you can meet so many awesome characters that can join your squad, and they've also just released their new 7.2 update. And Fahua got this super cool Phoenix-like battle suit, which is the strongest battle suit ever. This update also features a cool new pinball minigame, plenty of new outfits to wear, and so much more to explore. Another thing about this game that I love is that the developers are constantly updating this game, and part two to the game is coming out very soon, and that'll feature tons of new additions. If you're looking for a game you can enjoy anytime and anywhere, Honkai Impact 3rd is that game. Go check out the new update with the link in the description, and use code KFPHOENIX to get a ton of free rewards that you can't get anywhere else. So the last time I went to this Animal Planet channel, I watched a few of their YouTube shorts, but this time, I had to change it up. So, I went to their YouTube videos. I saw a video of baby bunnies inside of a hole that seemed pretty normal. I also saw a video of a bunny just eating his dinner. I really wanted to expose this person, so I ended up watching every single other video on their channel to try to find out anything that I could. Turns out, every single YouTube video on this channel is kind of normal. That's right around the time when I was about to give up. I really wanted to expose this channel because so many people were telling me about how bad they were, but I just wasn't finding the bad videos. I wasn't seeing it. But then, a few hours later, I was sitting on YouTube. I was just scrolling through shorts, and you're not gonna believe what I found. So there's a guy pulling a string, and there's some food attached to it. The bunnies really like the food, so they keep following the string and biting it, and then boom, what? This dude made the bunnies fall into a dusty hole, and then he covered them up. This video that I stumbled upon was posted by that Animal Planet channel. Right when I realized that, I went right back to their channel to explore, and that's when I realized something. The reason I didn't find any bad videos last time was because this channel has 3,700 videos. 3,700 videos. Their channel looks super cute and nice at first, until you really dive deep. 
that's exactly what I did. There's another video on this channel where it looks like a guy is holding a string again, two white rabbits pop up, and then he pulls it. Unlike the last video, you can actually see how dirty the rabbits get from this. This dude literally even had the audacity to pick the phone up and show what he did. The people commenting on this video are so heated. People are actually mad at this person, and guess what? They ended up hearting the comments. People are calling them cruel. People are hating on them, and they're hearting the comments? Something isn't right here. There's another video on their channel of them recording two bunnies going into this plastic bottle contraption thing. If they try to get out of the bottle, the bottle ends up tipping over and it blocks them from leaving. The title of this video though says Rabbit Animals. OMG, so cute. What is cute about that? There's another video on their channel where there's a girl holding a yellow bag. Under her is a big hole and this yellow bag that she's holding is filled with bunnies. She proceeds to pour the bunnies out of the bag into this hole and all these bunnies are alive. There's no reason for them to be going into this hole. There's no reason to be recording. There's no reason for them to be in that yellow bag. It looks like there was about 35 to like 40 bunnies in that bag and I bet it was hard to breathe in there. Once I watched a couple of the bad videos, they did not stop popping up. This video is a funny joke. So they have a bunch of food at the table and then they put their pet bunny rabbit in the middle, but they're like, just kidding. The bunny is obviously alive. The sound that's playing on this video is somebody laughing. It just seems like a funny little video where the bunny's in the middle. Turns out this is not funny at all. That bunny that's laying on its back in the middle is not supposed to be laying like that. Bunnies are not supposed to be on their backs almost ever. Somebody in the comments section explained that you should never do this to a bunny because it causes their heart to start beating extremely fast. I ended up looking this up just to confirm it and online it says to never do this to your pet bunny. It is not healthy. This is not good for bunnies to be on their back. But guess what? They didn't just make one video like this. Look at what I found. They made another video where they put a bunny on its back just because they think it's funny. Really? The comment section of this video is more people explaining how bad this is for the bunny. This sucks. It doesn't stop there though, because there's a video on their channel where the guy recording goes up to a baby bunny, picks it up, and just sits there holding it. He's just recording, holding this bunny. It seems like a normal video until you turn the sound up. This bunny is terrified. This is a baby bunny screaming for help. And this person is enjoying it. By this point, I had watched like a hundred different videos from this channel. They were all horrible, but then I found the worst video of them all. They posted a video of hundreds of baby bunnies just laying down all right next to each other. It seems like a pretty cute video, right? Once you realize what's really happening in this video though, your day will be ruined. If you look at the top of the screen, you can see that these bunnies are in a cardboard box. This box doesn't look that big and there's hundreds of bunnies. The more you watch the video, the more you can tell just how bad this is. There are bunnies on the bottom that don't have enough room. There's bunnies on top of other bunnies that are trying to fight to the top just to get some air. The comments on this video are desperately trying to tell this person who posted this to stop. They're saying that the bunnies can't breathe and the person behind this Animal Planet channel is just hearting the comments. Harding comments is supposed to be something good. Why are they doing this? After I saw this video and I saw those comments, I knew that I had to figure out who this was. I knew I had to try as hard as I could to stop them. Now, there's a video on their channel that I don't think I should even show. I'm probably going to blur it or pixelize it. It's basically a video of a bunny rabbit that has really long teeth and uh, they're cutting the teeth. This looks extremely painful for the bunny and if you go to the comments, you can see people saying that this animal should have had its teeth cut months ago by an actual vet, somebody who actually works with animals, not a random person. But guess what? The Animal Planet channel replied to this person who commented that and they didn't just heart the comment, they answered this person. Thank you for support us? Really? That's when I realized that finding out who this person was was going to be way harder than I thought. They don't even speak English. Anytime they reply to somebody's comment, they just say thank you. Somebody can be calling them out and they literally say thank you because they don't speak English. I knew it was gonna be very hard to figure out who this was, but I was still gonna try. The first thing I wanted to do was check and see if they had any social media accounts. Like sometimes you can find an Instagram or a Facebook or something like that. I looked all over the channel and turns out they didn't have anything at all. The only thing they did have was an email. 
I could send them an email, but that wouldn't really do much. They could easily just ignore me. They do have a community tab on their channel, but when you click on the community tab, there's absolutely nothing there. I was starting to give up at this point. There was really nothing I could find. So I decided to read their channel description. Their channel description is a whole essay about Animal Planet this and that, blah, 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 subscribe my channel, blah, blah, blah. But then you see something weird. Our purpose when making compilations is not to steal people's videos, but to share these videos. Their description basically says that these are compilation videos. They take videos from other people and upload them to their channel. That's when I realized that this is a huge problem. They have 1 million subscribers. They get millions of views on all these videos from all these people who are hating on them. They are definitely making money from these videos with how many views they're getting. There are thousands of people commenting on their videos, telling them to stop. But this channel isn't going to listen. Guess what though? We have the power. After I upload this video, I would not be surprised to see that their videos get deleted. That's just what we do around here. Now that all of you know how bad this channel is, we can stop them. I hope one day we can make it so they never make money from their channel again. And I hope this teaches them a lesson. Don't mess with animals, buddy. Because guess what? We're going to find you and we're going to ruin your channel. If you want to see some more videos where I expose YouTubers, click this video right there. I made a video about a guy who faked his death. And if you don't want to watch that, I made a video on some of the most annoying YouTubers ever. So click that video if you want to see that. Peace out.